Um, I kind of, uh, a different route to most really, um, over kind of a, a dinner with the Nigel Tristan Davis and his lads, he kind of mentioned um, I was kind of right by frame size and, and way to go, to give it a go, so I, I give it a go at the racing school and, and went from there. Football, as I say, growing up in Liverpool, you, you're born with a ball at your feet, so um, I knew nothing else, it was very natural, but um, I think football probably helped me with kind of balance, coordination, things like that, definitely difficult difference as well it took me a while to kind of get used to basic things trotting that most of the lads probably learned to probably three years old you know so yeah, it was different but what a challenge I accepted and, and, and grabbed all of I kind of I remember kind of at the tender age of probably about seven doing lucky 15s with my granddad in front of the TV and I, I remember kind of you know I used to love sprinter sacking and stuff when he was coming through so um, he was definitely probably a flagship horse for me coming through and, and Paul Carvey as well kind of Granddad used to love him, so I used to love the way he rode and he rode with so much confidence and he was very quiet, you know, so I try and kind of do what he does, you know. There's no chance of ever winning anything anytime soon, so I'll say grade one win. <laughs> I kind of, as I said, I'm pretty level at it. I don't get too high and I don't get too low just because I know how fast they can say and um, look, I enjoy it when we win and but when we lose, I kind of I dust myself off and, and go again, you know. Fair weather, man. I quite like the sun, you know. Um, so today is going to be difficult and mud in your face and things. So if I could ride in Dubai every day in my life, I think I would. <laughs> Probably Max Verstappen, I just think, going wicked fast and around a circuit all over the world and in that car would be pretty epic. Yeah, ask questions um, and I've took it, kind of, a lot of people think, you know, some questions may be stupid, but I don't think any question is stupid really and I, I'd say to anyone a bit of advice, ask as many questions as you can. A lot of the lads would probably say weight, but I, I, I'm lucky I don't really struggle with my weight, so maybe the cold winter mornings, you know. I've already achieved it, win it, ain't you? Slightly closer, but nowhere near. Close enough to beat Josh the Boss, who is going to follow up his Warwick win in the hands of J.D. Neal. Watch live racing now on racingtv.com.